We got some jumps. That was heck of a. And here's Juan Thornhill from the University of Virginia, another Senior Bowl guy. They ought to be proud there, Jim Daggy. And how about that for 44 inches? How about Marvell Tell? Oh, I know third. he's explosive. I'd say 42 inches in the vertical equates to explosive. And here's another guy that we haven't talked about a whole lot. We saw him at the Senior Bowl Mobile, Sheldrick Redwine. Oh, wow. He and Jaquan Johnson at Miami teamed up to be a nice safety tandem. Hey, now, this is one of these guys that's just big. Look at Justice Hill, Rich. He ran a 44 flat 40 and then a 40 inch vertical jump. All right, Paris Campbell, we expected him to kind of test like a freak right out of Ohio no State. Doubt. No Looking doubt. at wide receivers. I think 40 inches tells you Woo. freak at the point of attack. But this guy, I don't think anyone did a better job today selling themselves. Let's see what he uh, slapped at the vertex. 39 and a half. 39. Your TJ Hawkinson. Hey, look, there's been comparisons to Rob Gronkowski. Oh, I think that's a little bit too high, but you can't really own a combine performance like this guy's been doing. Damian Harris compared him a little bit to Mark Ingram as a runner when you watch him there at Alabama. AJ Brown, he's one of the two wideouts you would want to keep your eye on out of Ole Miss. Dexter Williams from Notre Dame. See him jump. I bet you this is a pretty good number. 36. 36. Uh, Ed Oliver, this is oh, yeah. this was it. Yep. You're seeing the Ed Oliver workout for today because he didn't do anything on the field. He 32 the on the, the bench. Broad. Started only one game a season ago at UCF. Had a great day. Look at that. Caleb and Gary out of Washington. Pretty solid workout as well. And this is a guy that stands over six foot seven and then jumping 33 and a half. Broad jumps and vertical jumps. This is one of your favorite players, DJ. And I don't think he disappointed with 33 and a half. Checking out Irv Smith Jr. from Alabama. 32 and a half. This guy I absolutely love in terms of movement skills. And let's see what he can do getting up in the air there. 31. How about Draymond Jones from Ohio State? Now, these Ohio State kids have put on a show here at the Combine, haven't they? And then what about Quinn and Williams? But we talked about the athleticism. That's 303 pounds that just went up in the air over 30 inches in the vertical. Andre Dillard, we saw his athleticism show. How about jumping? 29. Not bad. And then Jonah Williams, the All-American left, ta left tackle from Alabama. That's the second best since 03, I believe. We just saw 11-4 and we were wild. What do we say at 11-9? equates to explosive, and so does this. Whoa, 11-4. 11-4 in the broad jump. I think Luke Falk is still sore from the hit Marvell Tell put on. Oh, my goodness. You're seeing one of 10 Buckeyes that's here this weekend in Indianapolis. How about the broad jump of 11-3? That's superstar stuff right there. 10-10. Jeez. Outstanding. <coughs> he was propelled by the green running. He ran fast, too. 10-10 on the broad. 4-4, four, 8-40. Four, eight, eight backs. Break four five. You see Red Wan a little more ten, towards ten. the line of scrimmage and, and a little bigger Johnson is more and than Johnson can field. rove. But boy, he he topped our expectations. Oh, and look at this, a 10-3 broad jump from a tight end. Question his fluidity, Peter, and, and whether he can bend well and all those things. I know this, he is athletic as all ten, get two. out in terms of that. 10-1 in the broad. Solid. We'll see you at your pro day, Ed Oliver. Mm -hmm. Look at that. See what he weighs. Chris, you want to deal with him in the slot? You want to go in the slot with A.J. Brown and deal with him coming off the line of scrimmage? You see that size? And you guys have probably already seen the viral picture that went out of those yeah. wide receivers. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's pretty good right there. And then the broad jump of almost 10 feet. So he's got the explosion that you're looking right for, there. but he's still a good blocker in the run game because of positioning. Not so bad. Josh Oliver, 9-9. Nine, nine. Oh. There you go. If you want to see somebody fill the alley and deliver some huge shots, he's your guy. Abram does it. Was absolutely outstanding. Very clean, very smooth in his movements. We've talked about it before. He only started one game this past year at UCF. And then a broad of almost nine and a half feet. Look at him stick the landing right there. So he's going to be a starting right tackle in the NFL before too long, you know, because that's what he's going to hear at home. Of course, right. Pops was a 1993 first round selection. The New Orleans Nine Saints. Two. Nine. Not quite as far as Quentin Williams. <laughs> but let me tell you something, Chris. Far enough. And then 8 8 on the broad jump. Okay, no, no big deal. But we saw his movement skills on tape. Daniel Jeremiah broke him down very well, despite a lot of talk about what do you him say? moving inside to guard. I think he moves inside to guard and becomes an all pro guard or, or a pro bowl guard.